Hey friends, welcome back to another video. My name is Katie Steckley and here on my channel I love to talk all things filmmaking and travel. Today I want to show you a really easy method for making slow motion video in Premiere Pro. Step one starts in filming. This is probably the most important part. You need to select a high frame rate to film in. If your final product is going to be in 24 frames per second, then you need to shoot in a higher frame rate such as 60 frames per second or 120 frames per second. Once you've selected that, it's also very important that you match your shutter speed to your new frame rate. If you normally shoot in 24 frames per second, then you should be shooting with a shutter speed of 1 over 50, but if you're switching to 60 frames per second, then your new shutter speed should be 1 over 120 or 1 over 125 because a lot of cameras won't have the option to shoot at 1 over 120 shutter speed. If the frame rate you're using is 120 frames per second, then make your shutter speed 1 over 250. It's important that your shutter speed matches your frame rate so that you have the correct amount of motion blur in the video so that it looks natural to the eye when you're finished exporting it. Step two, it's time to do some math. We need to figure out how much you can slow down your clip before you start losing frames. Let's use the example of shooting in 60 frames per second for a final product of 24 frames per second. You can slow down your 60 frames a second clip by 40% and it will still look good at 24 frames a second. 24 divided by 60 is 0.4, which is 40%. Of course, you can slow down footage that is shot at any frame rate, but it's going to start to look choppy because you don't have all those extra frames in there to help make it look smooth. Step three is editing. Open up Premiere Pro and import your clips into your new project. This is super easy. There are two ways to do this. You can either right click or command click to get the menu to pop up and select speed slash duration, or you can use the keyboard shortcut command or control R. Once you're there, you just have to select the rate that you want to slow it down by. So for this 60 frames per second clip, I'm gonna slow it down by 40%. And now you've got some beautiful, smooth, slow motion and it only took a couple simple steps. Thanks so much for watching this video. If you found it helpful, please give it a thumbs up. If you wanna see more filmmaking tutorials like this one, then make sure you hit the subscribe button right here so that you don't miss any of my future videos. And while you're at it, why not just hit the little notification bell icon so you get notified when I upload a new video. If you wanna learn more about Premiere Pro for beginners, then check out this playlist. I like to make my tutorials really straightforward and easy so that you can follow along as a Premiere Pro beginner. Thanks so much for watching. As always, I love you all. I hope you're following your dreams and I'll see you in the next one. Bye.